My name is Emily Kwong. I am a full-time MBA student at UW Foster. Before the program, um, I was an HR business partner at a company called Real Self. While I was at Real Self, the company was experiencing hyper growth and with that, a lot of changes. Um, so inadvertently, I was invited to a lot of conversations about workforce planning and strategy. And very early on, um, I knew that I just didn't understand the business aspects enough to be making these really big recommendations about what to do with certain business units. I knew I wanted to strengthen my business acumen um, so that I could become a more effective HR leader one day. When I was looking at different programs, trying to decide where to go, um, there were three universities I looked at, Foster being the top one. Um, I looked at a couple of different things. I wanted a, a smaller, more intimate um, class size. I wanted to be able to get to know my classmates on a one-on-one -on -one basis. Um, there was also the aspect of whether or not I was going to get a lot of opportunities in a leadership capacity. So some of the schools I looked at, um, they might have kind of like a, a specialization that you could get in leadership. Um, but I also loved that Foster offered the opportunity for you to take on whatever leadership position you really wanted and, and shape it for yourself. Um, I think the, the moment that really solidified my decision for me was that I had gone and visited campus um, at all three universities, met with students, and attended classes. But I think when I spoke with the students at Foster, time and time and again, I really felt like I could connect with these people on a very like human level, and that for a majority of these students, they were deeply passionate about something bigger than themselves, whether it was sustainability or, or equity, um, that you could tell that their decision to go to school was driven by more than just financial success, and that was really important to me. I know people say that part of the MBA program is the network that you inherit, that you get to leverage, um, but I really feel like with foster students, when you meet a fellow foster student, um, you really take the time to get to know them, understand what their motivations are. Instead of just, you know, kind of giving them one word answers to their questions, you're thinking deeply about what, what are the next steps, like who else can I connect you with to really help get you to the next level. Community to me at Foster is you identifying your your need for help in a certain area and people kind of rallying around you to get you the help you need. One of the most uh, pivotal moments of community building that was demonstrated to me was when Christine Pham, our VP of Diversity, um, put together something called the People of Color Town Hall. You know, it was something that we had never had before. Um, I don't know if there had been previously a lot of conversations about what it's like to be a person of color in, in an MBA program, but I think when we all kind of got into that Zoom room and started sharing a lot of our experiences, that was when I finally felt like other people understood where I was coming from and, and were experiencing similar things um, and were really able to help me to like talk about and think about best paths forward on how to tackle some of these challenges. One of my favorite experiences um, of my first year in the program is our applied strategy class. So uh, during winter quarter, you are put in a team and you get paired up with a company locally and you get to work on a real business problem. Um, and so I was paired with Accolade and working on mapping out their customer journey um, for their government solution. And I just felt like that was such an impactful project um, and it was really my first time doing anything consulting related and I felt like I really loved the experience. Stacey Duhon, who's at the Career Management Center, um, was also just I think one of my biggest cheerleaders, you know, through my first year. Um, when I came into the program, I had a really clear thought of what I was going to do and a very clear, like specific company of where, like where I wanted to do that. And um, when those opportunities didn't work out, it was really Stacy who kind of helped me figure out 
next steps, different options, and gave me the confidence and I think the clarity to put a new plan um, to kind of chart a new path. After working with Stacy through the long recruitment process, um, I'm actually headed to Accenture for strategy consulting um, at the end of my, my MBA experience. <music>